Hey guys, just wanted to talk to you about Yucca rostrata. I have several of these planted in my garden in addition to a few in pots like this one. Um, they are native to parts of southwestern U.S. and northern Mexico and they're commonly referred to as a beaked yucca. Uh, they're distinguished by the similar looking yucca rigida, by the uh, thinner, more flexible leaflets and the leaflets also tend to have a uh, telltale twist to them. So if you look at the profile here, you can see how the leaflets are twisting towards the end. That's very typical of yucca rostrata. They are very tolerant of drought, heat, and cold. Um, as it grows, they tend to develop a trunk to them. And it can also split after they flower into multiple trunks. The leaflets are a beautiful silver blue gray color in appearance, although there is some variation in color. Uh, they can even appear mostly green. The leaflets, as they age and die, they fold down to the trunk forming a skirt, which you can trim or leave. Uh, they like full sun and can withstand temperatures down to minus 10 Fahrenheit or minus 23 Celsius. They do very well in our Pacific Northwest climate, uh, which is temperate and has lots of rainfall in the winter, as long as they're planted in well-draining soil and or on a slope. So let me show you a few others around the yard, just so you can uh, compare the different sizes at different stages of their uh, growth. So I have a young rostrata here. This is only about maybe two or three years old. another rostrata here this is about uh, four years old it's about uh, 18 to 20 inches high right now and as you can see with the color there's some variation there this one has a bit more green rather than the silver blue it's still no trunk over here I have another one planted that's actually got three in it. So there's three individual plants in here. Pick this up from a nursery. There's one there. Another one in here. And a third one facing this way. So as it grows, it should be pretty interesting. We'll, uh, as it starts trunking, we'll have triple trunks on it. Here's my largest... Uh, Rostrata. Not sure how old this one is because I got it shipped to me with a trunk already. It's got a, about a 12 inch trunk on it. And it took a while to establish and to root because it was shipped bare root. And now it's starting to shoot on new growth. So I'm hoping it will really take off after this year. Also, uh, I tagged some pictures of the larger rostrata, just so to give you an idea of what they look like when they're much bigger. Give them a try. They're uh, great yuccas, very hardy, and great for this climate that we're in zone 8B slash 9A Pacific Northwest, BC, Canada.